the first step was to apply base coat and you can use white or you can use a clear base coat. Um, so whichever choice you like. And then I have applied one color of the clean color uh, pastel orange and I'm going to apply another coat. And I'm gonna let this dry fully and then we'll move on to the next step. While that's drying, I'm going to move on to the Sephora by OPI. I come in peas and I'm going to apply a second coat. Again, I have applied a white base coat. That's completely optional. It's just something I choose to do to protect my nails from discoloration from so many dark colors nail polish okay so I'm gonna let these two colors dry completely and then we'll move on now I'm going to apply uh, some Milani this is diamond dazzle glitter polish Okay, so now it's time to do the very easy camo and for that I'm using the large end of my daughter the large end and um, it's very very simple I have a piece of extra paper here and sorry I was so close to the camera guys and I'm just going to put a dot of let me put it a little bit in the camera so you can See what I'm talking about? A little dot of the nail polish on the paper. And I'm just going to take it from there and I'm going to place my um, pastel orange color where I want it on my nail. Okay? So with the other nails, I have started from the front and it doesn't have to be a shape necessarily. You just want the color on there some kind of way okay and you want to go on the tip so really no pattern to it obviously the more nail you have the more area you can work with Next, I'm doing the same thing with the black polish. And you want to make sure that you kind of bleed into the other colors. Okay, so I'm pretty pleased with how that looks. I'm gonna go ahead and clean this up and I'll be right back. Okay, so I'm gonna add a few small rhinestones. 